While they may look like tornadoes, water spouts and land spouts are cousins of sorts of that severe weather event. While they may look impressive, they generally do not produce impressive results. Tornadoes usually form in the rotating updraft or other rotation within a storm. Land spouts, however, form when the thunderstorm is still growing and does not have a rotating updraft. They generally occur when two air masses collide. As a result, land spouts are generally short-lived, weak, and look thin and wispy. They generally won't produce any damage, but could stir up some strong winds. Water spouts are similar to land spouts. They also form from the surface up to the cloud and are generally weak and rope-like. Multiple water spouts can form at the same time, creating a neat sight on the horizon. Water spouts and land spouts are generally hard to detect on radar because they sit low in the sky, are small in size, and weak in intensity. The National Weather Service generally relies on eyewitness accounts to take note that they occurred. Until next time for WeatherWise, I'm Alex Kirchner.